Hello and welcome to more awesome collection, uh, classic toys, classic toys from the 1960s pop culture, uh, TV edition. If you'd like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell and reply. Uh, these are for toys made by Remco, uh, for Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea. Uh, they have the classic yellow submarine. Uh, the sea view and then in the larger play set uh, they had some plastic like a, a whale some figures and then a plastic like a, a squid and these are the two vehicles that they they came out with uh, these are collectible on themselves uh, you can see the label there calls it the sea crawler you can see the stylized uh, turtle and then, then this is a mini sled if you look closely in here, there's two silverish plastic figures. These are meant to stay on, so they're not supposed to come off. We'll look, take a look at each one and closely. Uh, so a lot of play value here. This has some wheels on it, so in the ground you can move it along. And then, of course, way back then, kids probably brought these in the tub to play with. Or if they had a pool or something, bring it into water and have fun with it. And see, over time, it's uh, from the glue, it's miscolored a little bit, but overall, it's nice. Sometimes these are broken off in the collectible. Or uh, This is more scuffed up. This isn't too bad. And you can see the figures in there. He's moving around in his seat a little bit. Uh, see, very plain bottom. They don't even put the Remco name on these on it, but it, that's the company that makes them. And of course the Sea View came by itself. I don't have that one at the moment, otherwise I would have included it here in the video. And then they had the Deluxe set, <coughs> which was like a Sears exclusive, and it came in a big uh, window box, and you'd see these with the submarine set up. Let's take a look at the crawler. Very cool, look at the, the way the coat wheels would work very sturdy plastic and then uh, it's got a moving grabber go from side to side up and down and then pulling the lever you can grab things with it so very fun uh, classic collectible these go for in like super mint condition upwards to about a hundred dollars each and then you can probably get them for uh, half that or so on a good buy, and depending on the condition. Very fun. Uh, fun Voyage to the Bottom Sea, one of my favorite adventure type shows, sci fi from the 1960s. I have the collection on uh, DVD. I have some comics which I'll be showing in the future. Uh, they got on the cover of a TV guide. And then they had articles in there. They had board games, lunch boxes, and so forth. I have the lunch boxes uh, with Thermos. will be doing that. And more uh, <coughs> puzzles. Uh, they made a quite fair amount of uh, memorabilia for it. Uh, what we call now, or back then, was uh, merchandise, toys for it. Uh, a nice card, trading card. I believe I have that, and I have it in a a binder that I had made up with the Voyage logo on the binder and dig that out in the future and show that. A very fun Irwin Allen show that came out in 64, ran for four seasons, his most successful show. And then uh, Lost in Space, of course, more famous with the robot, Dr. Smith and Will. That was from 65 to 68. And then they also came out with the Time Machine and Land of the Giants, those were uh, Irwin Allen's big sci-fi shows of the 60s. And in the 70s, he was more uh, known for his disaster movies like uh, The Towering Inferno, Poseidon Adventure. Till next time, more uh, awesome collection, uh, pop culture, classic toys. Thanks for watching.